has ever talked about Jesus. I haven't met a single Be so loud. Fucking let me just <laughs> fucking do this. Jesus Christ of Almighty. Okay. Okay, it's gonna save for me. Welcome. Guys, my name is Robert Gay. They're playing what remains of Ian Flinch. Uh, so basically, this is a narrative story, I think. I don't know too much about this game, to be honest. I never heard of it. Never um, played it. Never heard about it. I heard it was good. That's all I know. I heard it was just good. I just heard so many people saying, "Oh, Ian Flinch is so good." Uh, primitive story, and I just don't understand. <laughs> Like, I literally am only the first person to, uh, like, I don't know what it is. How is it, how is, oh, it's very good. A description. Ethan, is that how you say it? Ethan Flinch. How you do this? Okay, R3, R2. A lot of this isn't going to make sense to you. And I'm sorry right. about that. I'm just going to start at the beginning, with the house. Right. Hook. So this is like a story. Okay, this is actually good visuals, to be honest. I lived here until I was 11, but I wasn't allowed inside half the rooms. What's this? Inside the mailbox were bills from seven years ago, marked urgent, open immediately. It kind of reminds me of Telltale, kind of it. I hadn't been back since my brother Lewis's funeral. That's cool. But it kills my PS4, the air up. In her will, my mother left me a key, but didn't tell me what it unlocked. Maybe she thought I'd know. Or she thought the mystery would be enough to bring me back. The flinches. Oh, which way do I go? Left or right? Well, since my name is Lefty, I'm going to go left. Imagine I die instantly. <laughs> the truth is, even after I inherited the house, I never thought I'd come back to it. Well, that's kind of what life is all about. It's it's about going back about into the past. The house knew the answers to. Yeah. The if it woods jumps, the house have always been uncomfortably silent, as if they're about to say something but never do. That's deep. Oh, uh, it's so eerie. Does it really matter which way I went? Right or left? The house was exactly like I remembered it. The way I'd been dreaming about it. I said it would be. As a child, the house made me uncomfortable in a way I couldn't put into words. Okay. Missing. There's like a lot of missing posters. Now, as a 17 year old, I knew exactly what those words were. I was afraid of the house. I hoped what? the key might unlock the front door. It didn't. What? Then what am I gonna do? If it's supposed to open... What is it supposed to open? Surely... What the fuck was that? Oh, I thought that was a... I thought that was a clown under the goddamn thing. Why don't I just lift up the shot? Why can't you use your hand and lift up the shutter of the fucking sh uh, shed? The fucking PS4 is dying over here. 
Oh, that's scary. Oh my god. The doggy door used to be a lot easier when I was 11. Huh. Maybe it's because all you are. Maybe it's because all the um the power had been turned off the night we left. Oh, that's 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 the normal. First time in years. Oh, well, January. Home. January 10th. <gasps> There's my birthday, January 8th. Right there, Thursday. Okay. What day is it today? Imagine imagine this day took place on fucking January 8th. Apple pie. I don't know how you make apple pie, but, but I don't instead care. of a family, there were just memories of one. Okay. I hate this eeriness. Can we have like a teammate or something like that? Like, how like a person Lewis with me? Working at the cannery, we all got sick of eating salmon, except our cat, Molly. Well, what do you want? The table was still a wreck from the night we left. I'm mildly interested about Nothing the story. Nothing in the house looked abnormal. There was just too much of it, like a smile with too many teeth. True. Oh, what's this? Jukebox. Din, 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 din. How you do it? Wait, wait, wait. Great Grandpa Sven built a music box for Barbara, along with the rest of the house. That's cute. Why is there a big fault behind it? Oh, I'm not going in the basement. Mom Please. always told me to stay out of the basement, so I wasn't too surprised when the key Please. didn't fit. Oh, thank God. I, I if 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 she said a lot that. Of things got left behind in the whirlwind of that last night. Edie told me once that every finch who ever lived is buried somewhere in the library. Hmm. I wonder what the keys. After oh. Mom disappeared, Mom sealed up all the bedrooms. Then Edie retaliated and drilled peepholes. Imagine I look through and there's an My eye. My Sam spent seven years sharing a room with his dead brother, Calvin. As a kid, I just assumed every house had peepholes and sealed rooms you weren't allowed inside of. The last time I was in Edith Sr.'s room, I was ten and she was painting my portrait. So am I supposed to go in here? Whenever people ask me about my family, the first thing they always want to know about is Barbara. Edie's father, Odin, built the original house. Barbara was a child star for two years, until America grew out of it. Hmm. Interesting. What about you? I don't, I don't understand, but... I oh, spent God. a lot of time playing in Great Uncle Walter's room. Lewis told me there were secret passages, but I never believed him. Let me guess, it opens this book. Oh, of course! The key opens to a Turns book. Out, my mom was really good at keeping secrets. Oh, 20 Leagues Under Sea, that's the best book. Oh, wait, what? Now it was time to find out what my mom had been afraid of. What? Let me when guess. the paintings on the wall, it was clear my brother Milton had been here before me. Reading this, maybe it sounds like I had a plan, but I had no idea what was behind that door. Just like I had no idea where all this was gonna lead. I grew up looking at Molly's room through the peephole. December 13th, 1947. Dear diary, I'll be gone soon but I wanted to tell somebody about what's gonna happen. It started when mom sent me to bed without dinner. Wait, what? I woke up and I was starving. So I looked around for something to eat. The gerbil food was dry, but I didn't mind it. What? She ate the gerbil food? Um, by the way, can I ask, um, why is this so creepy? Like, it's like creepy atmosphere. I don't understand that, to be honest. I kept eating and eating. Right. Um, people always do that. Everyone does that at some point. Just eat 
I toothpaste. ate a lot of things that night. Uh, no one eats that stuff. Because it's quite hard, I say. But then I heard chirping outside my window. Oh, is that a bird? It was a barn swallow going back to her nest. Her nest. Okay. I reached out for her. What? Are you going to eat the cat? Uh, the bird? And suddenly... What? What the? I was a cat. What? That makes no sense. How did you become a cat? What? That makes no gosh darn sense. What? The... What? That makes no sense. How can you combine DNA with a bloody cat? What? Can, it, it does like does she have superpowers? Maybe. Maybe that's it. Is this a mama bird or is this just like a normal bird? <gasps> oh, I hear the little bell. That's cute. That's cute. I tried to I'm living in my dream really right now. <gasps> Oh, so cute! Rah! Let me catch ya! Yeah. Come on! Ah, oh, you be nice in my belly! Rah! Oh, Mom and Dad close. didn't even look at me. That doesn't look like your mom and dad. That looks like mannequins. It looks like mannequins from Black Ops 2. <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. Okay, my PS4 is calming down. Oh Jesus, this cat can jump! Rawr. Come on. <laughs> I'm like Assassin's Creed. <sighs> I'm like Assassin's Creed. Assass uh, assassin cat. Rawr. And I almost got her. I almost got her. I almost got ya. I'm a cat. Rawr. This is my dream come true. I could tell she was getting Damn really it. tired. Come on. Yeah, I was up in the big tree. I promised Dad I wouldn't climb it anymore. Come All on. I cared about was eating. You love it inside my belly. I gobbled her You can't up. get anywhere now. What the? And so what are you doing? I was an owl. What? <laughs> First, that makes so all sad. I heard was the wind. The wind. Then I heard little teeth nibbling in the grass. Well, I can't hear that. Thank you very much. Fuck. I don't see anything. Rabbits. Am I blind? Well, oh, rabbit. There you go. So it seems like you can attack and... Oh, got him. Got him! Man, I'm good. I imagined his face looking up and seeing mine through my talons. Wait, did you just eat a hole? And I didn't chew one bit. What? And I flew off to find something bigger. Bigger. Let me guess, you turned into a monster or something like that. That's kind of like light. It's kind of like the evolution. It's like kind of like. A rabbit. It's kind of like the evolution system, like, um, it, like, you know, like, um, how, um, basically it's, um, the cycle of life, isn't it? That's what, no, the circle of life, that's what it's called. Like, all... Oh, there we go. A mama rabba. Gotcha. She Man. was almost too big to carry. I started choking, but I couldn't stop eating. Oh my and god. Suddenly, I was a shark. What? What? That makes no sense. What? What? <laughs> Look at the right though. <laughs> Shark! I rolled oh. off a cliff and into the ocean. 
I love the ragdoll. Oh my god, that was so funny. Off her foot so and it tasted really good. This is so funny. I like the part where it's just like the the shark looks like he's about to die when you know the ragdoll. <laughs> where am I going? I don't know where I'm going to be honest. What? What you became? When I opened my eyes, everything had changed. You became an octopus. Oh, I like you can uh, actually hit the words. That's cool. I'm an octopus. Now I was a monster, and I smelled people everywhere. What did I just say? What's this game? Is this game what's it called? What's that game called about um? Where you play as the monster instead. The reverse horror game, I think that's what it's called. The reverse horror game, or Morbius. I, I think Markiplier played it, and I don't remember the name of it. I was big, but I moved real quiet. The fuck is this game? This game is so fucked up. I wanted to stop, but also I didn't. Really, Irish Rovers? What will we do with a drunken Passenger, I was still hungry. Right. Across the water, I smelled a thing. Something I had to have, so I swam towards it. Right. What happened then? Wow. I slithered onto the sand, and the good smell went into an old pipe. The good smell. Hmm. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, this is her room. Wait a minute, this is her room. How can. Wait, what? This is her room. How can I be the monster if this is her mo uh, mo uh Oh my god. All my stomach started growling. And suddenly, I was me again. Let me guess. Let me guess. It's waiting for me to fall asleep. But it's not going to wait much longer. It needs to be, and we both know I will be delicious. Oh god, you're gonna get eaten. What the fuck? Burn that book! I'm not sure if I believed all of that, but I'm sure Edie would have.
This will be obvious later, but my mom never told me any of these stories. Edie would have, okay. but mom didn't like bringing up the past. Okay. Why can't you say to Eddie, well, hey, I want to know? When we adopted a stray kitten, she was the one who named it Molly. I spent a lot of time in Great Grandma Edie's room. Her room was like a museum. All right, um... For 500 years, the Finches have been famous throughout Norway for their fortune. And misfortune. Wait, can we not, um, select the thing? Odin Finch buries the latest victims of the family curse. His wife, Ingeborg, and their newborn son, Johan. On January 7th, 1937, he set sail with his family One day and his house, birthday. hoping to leave the curse behind. But 40-foot waves off the coast of Washington send the house and Odin to the bottom of the sea. Why would you send your house on with this exact same boat? Odin's daughter Edie, with husband Sven and baby Molly, step ashore on their new home, Orcas Island. Odin Finch is the first to be buried in the new family cemetery. His daughter Edie is already dreaming of a new Finch house. Okay, we saw everything. Whatever's wrong with this family, it goes back a long ways. So we have a lot of people. We have... Okay, I get ya. So this is like the family tree. We're supposed to know what everyone is. And what everyone's backstory is. So that's gonna take me a long time. So we did Molly, we did Eth. So I think we are going to do uh, a lot of people. I don't care which side I go for, as long as we do it and we know who did it. Who who, who is it? Hmm. So I I'm gonna leave it like that. That was pretty. Oh my god, that was weird. But I'm mildly interested. I'm mildly interested on in what this game is about. 